All right, with the product page complete, it is time for us to build the news page. Mm. And in the last video, we kind of established that format for what these pages are going to look like. So we're going to follow that format as we set up our news page. Rob, right. take it away. Okay. Uh, here again is our products page. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, to start our new page, I'm going to duplicate this entire folder. And so now we have products copy. Let's change that to news. All right. And I'm going to hide the product. Our news page looks a lot like our product page. <laughs> As it turns out, on the, <laughs> uh, on the news page, we don't need logs. Ah, yeah, there you go. Um, so really what you're saving is just kind of the, the basic the, framework. Right, the framework, the, the things that we're going to reuse uh, throughout the rest of the site. Cool. So uh, I can just double-click this mm -hmm. real quick. News. How easy was that? That was pretty easy. Um, so now we're ready to add to add some news. <laughs> so let's switch back over to our Word Yay. document. Let's go to our big list of news. And there it is. Here it is. Let's see. We have wow, we have lots of articles. I don't know if they'll all fit on here, uh, but we'll definitely fit them all on the website. Right. This is just kind of a mock-up anyways. Right. Um, I don't think the bad weather bit's going to be included. Uh, right. We'll just pretend that I was somebody who is involved with the creation of the copy. So, uh, yeah, the headline is where the, the story right. actually starts. I see. The the bad weather bit, I think, was just notes that the person who was writing the copy left right. to themselves. Right. Okay. I Whoops. See. <laughs> I see. I see. Okay. Well, I'm just going to select a big chunk here. That's cool. And then just as a start. Yeah. And if we need more or less, we'll, we'll go from there. Yeah. No biggie. So I'm copying that in. I'm going to select a nice white so I can see what I'm pasting here. And you know what? I'm going to go back and click okay. on my text box again and drag it out so we don't have to put in line breaks. Ah, gotcha. Yeah, that'll be nice. Yeah. Now, you do have an extra blank text layer, just as a reminder. Right. I'll, I'll get rid of that uh, shortly. Nuke. Um, I clicked on my character palette because mm -hmm. we do not want Rockwell Bold. Um, we use Verdana again? Uh, yeah. Well, you know. No? Yes? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to start with Verdana and, and work from there. Okay, cool. And so I'm going to paste that in. Blam. Except oh. the color was yeah, blue. We need Let's make color. that uh, white. Yay! With and, crazy spacing. And we don't know where that crazy spacing is coming from, but we'll keep changing it. Auto. Uh, we don't want it to be completely uh, caps. So how's this looking? Oh, it's looking sharp already. It looks like a bunch of news stories. <laughs> Probably need to kind of space them out a little better. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, let's see, is that enough copy? Uh, that's just right if it works out. So, I'm going to um, select this text. Well, let's clean up, and I get rid of that layer. Actually, you know, I kind of like leaving a little bad weather thing in there. It looks kind of cool. <laughs> well, you know, we could take it out. We could leave it in. No, I, I, I like what you've, what, yeah, what we can do here. Okay. So, yeah. Okay, let's leave it in for now, and uh, we'll work with it. Okay, um, let's take a look here. I'm going to select Bad Weather. Bad Weather. Bad Weather. So we just wrote a song. Do you like our song? It's called Bad, bad Weather. weather. <laughs> By the Weathermen. Oh, we got to have a cooler band name than the Weather. <laughs> well, if you have a song called Bad Weather. Well, you know, just because <laughs> you, you sing a song about something doesn't mean you got to name your band after it. What is it if it's your only song? I guess it's true. <laughs> You can ignore us while we're, while we're just bantering here. Well, we're actually all we're doing is playing with text and doing a lot of things that we've already done like five and six and seven times in a row. Right. So we're just trying to keep the the video a little more interesting than usual. Um, I'm gonna change this headline uh, to a the different Weatherman font. does sound a lot better than like the web designers. <laughs> That'd be a terrible band name. That would be. I bet there are, is a web designer's band. There probably is. So uh, let's see. we got bad weather in all caps and pale blue. Right. Um, we're going down to recent spurts of harsh weather, uh, slow production. This is our headline. Yes, that's our headline. You got rid of the word headline at the beginning. That's right. So uh, I'm going to change the font here. I'm going to use another font that is a safe font uh, because it's included in all systems called Georgia. Mm -hmm. It is a very nice uh, serif font. Um, and it's particularly nice when it's larger, so I'm going to make it larger. Okay, awesome. Yeah, it looks really sharp. 
Yeah, that's a pretty cool font. I, I like that font. So I'm going to um, take out space between this and that. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to, uh, I don't want 12 point type. I want, let's say, 10 point type. Um, how's that looking? That's looking pretty. That's not bad. Pretty good. That would mm -hmm. certainly get a lot on the page. I'm going to make it 11, though. Okay. Um, kind of get some middle ground. Right. And so, let's see. What else do I want to change here? I think I want to change the color of my headline here. Okay. And um, I want to pick up this some color. Yellow. Yeah, so pick up yeah. a color that we've used already. Now, this is kind of a greenish yellow. It's kind of a dark yellow, and mm -hmm. it doesn't really go uh, too well. Blue. Yeah, it doesn't read too well. So I'm going to make it a little lighter. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's kind of nice. A little lighter still. Again, a sort of a, a subtle change in color. Right. So it just makes the headline softly stand out. Right. I like this. <clears throat> so this is good. I like. Uh, one thing I do want to change here is the bad weather. I want to make it one point smaller because it's it was sticking out just a little too much. Sure. So that's kind of like uh, the topic of the story. Yeah. The story think, is about bad weather. Right. These are these are the topics. And then yeah. we, so we have topic, then headline, then story. Gotcha. That's cool. Yeah, I think that works. So um, what else should we do? Uh, uh, now that we formatted the first paragraph, uh, we can go ahead and uh, let's place this a little bit uh, more strategically. Now, I was never all that awesome at typography, do you, but do you think maybe the headline should be brought up a little closer to bad weather? This right here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kind of narrow that gap a little bit? Yeah, let's, let's go ahead and do that. I don't see why that would be a problem. Although, I do think you have to select both of these lines. <laughs> <laughs> Photoshop is making fun of me. That's okay. <laughs> we don't mind. Bad Photoshop. Bad Photoshop. Bad Photoshop. It is ignoring it my pleas. No. It says no. You so I, I guess we can't do that. That's okay. <laughs> if we figure it out later, we'll, we'll change it. Yeah, <laughs> no problem. <laughs> All right. So we had the first uh, first paragraph formatted. Mm -hmm. uh, let's add a little interest to the page. Uh, because right now it's all text, um, or at least this part is all text. Okay. I left a little room over here. I'm going to add a picture. All right. Let's say... Pictures are cool. Open. Open. It's just taking a second. You have to give the machine a moment. Thinking. thinking. It's thinking to itself. Thinking. I remember how to open a file. I, I did it once a long time ago. Right, right. There we go. And here we are, finally. Yes. All right. We should have some waiting music. <laughs> <laughs> Load music. Now th I'll this is kind of an interesting picture. We, we could use this. Yeah, we could. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open it. Let's see what else we have. It's kind of newsworthy. This this you know this is a good picture. Yeah. Because it's um, things are happening. Sure. Uh, yeah, work. Yeah. Progress Work is in progress. Made. That's right. Yeah, it's, we new, are, it's newsworthy. We are making logs today. <laughs> we are making logs. Okay, so I'm going to use this picture. Okay, cool. You make the lumberjack go away. Yeah. Take your saw and go home. <laughs> this is industrial. This is even more than lumberjack. This He's is machinery. A He's okay. <laughs> All right. All righty. And then so we... I'm going to move him in here. It doesn't have to be huge. You know, I am going to make them a little bit bigger and, and then readjust this text okay. box. Gotcha. Because I do want this to be a little bit larger. And I'm going to move them up a little bit so we don't have any weird, weird margins up here. Mm -hmm. And when I'm done, I'll hit enter. Cool. Voila. And so um, let's go back, go ahead and reformat that paragraph real quick. That's not, that's not the tool. This, this is the tool. <laughs> And, and we and just scale in the text box and squish. Squish. You know, like it's scaling, up it's both scaling sides from the too, center because, because I'm holding down, down the alt key. Exactly. But you know what? I kind of like that. Okay. Uh, I kind of do like that. And you'll just adjust the spacing? Uh huh. We're experimenting here, folks. That's what it is. That's what it's all about when you're laying yeah. out that page. That's right. Um, that does cause us one problem, though, because the headline's too big now. 
<laughs> and for that one reason, always why, something. There's always something. I'm gonna stretch it back there out just a little bit. Cub lamb, just for us. Okay, so we have our picture. I'm gonna add a drop shadow to this picture, just to give it a little more to the page, and that's easily done by going cool. to the what is this called? Add a layer style. Okay, okay. we're going to add a layer style. All right. And we're going to add a drop shadow, just like we had talked about. Yay, drop shadows are cool. And, and if so, you've never used one before, basically you just uh, click on your add layer style button, right. you select drop shadow, and then you adjust all of these cute little sliders to right. change the look and shape of your shadow. You bet. Nothing to it, really. And so you really you have all these other options, too. If you've never used Photoshop, you can really trick it out. <laughs> Trick it out. Trick it out. Awesome. Now it's like a custom import car. Yeah, that's right. So it's a custom model. We don't the go for fast the and here. furious web designers. <laughs> that's right. So I'm gonna lighten up the shadow a little bit. Okay. Uh, I'm going to. I'm gonna make it bigger. No, I don't want it bigger. I'm going to leave it. Uh, and that's going to be good. I think. Wait. Do I want the shadow on this side, or do <laughs> I want it on this side? It is a choice to make. I'm going to put it on this side. Okay. Just because. Okay. All right. So I like this. Uh, let's go ahead and, re and format the rest of the rest of the text. Mm -hmm. uh, we, I'm going to pick up this blue again and just copy the value right out and paste it into paste it into here. Okay. When you're going back and forth between uh, Go Live and Photoshop, mm -hmm. the color palette and the and the hexadecimal system is really really a, a good shortcut. Cool for cut for copy and pasting your, yeah. your colors. So I'm going to get rid of that extra line there. Mm -hmm. I'm going to format our headline here to the Geneva. Was not Geneva Georgia. Georgia right? Georgia Georgia. Georgia on my mind. Up, 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 down, up, up, down, up down, down, right down, there. There we are. <laughs> we knew it was there It's somewhere. around there somewhere. <laughs> we'll find it sooner or later. As soon as I learn my alphabet, uh, right. I'm going to use our... <laughs> and I'm just going to use the color picker and... and oh, you're cheating now. That's, that's not cheating. That's it, cheating. It's all it part good, of the process. Um, what about uh, the all caps on the um, reforesting efforts? Right. Good, good catch there. I'll make that all caps. Not only will I make it all caps, but I will make it smaller. I'll make it 10 And we points. won't worry about cleaning up that gap there. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe. Maybe later. one day. Maybe later. Right. That's right. It's not important right now. Right. We, that's something we can fix and go live if necessary. Yes. And so, uh, you know, I don't think we have a section header for this one, do we? Is that the section header? Or is you can that just make one up, like media events or something, because yeah. it's an interview on a some right. TV show. Right, right, right. Media. This is our side, after all. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so once again, let's add that styling. Um, I'm going and to. And you're a web designer. They count on you to make those command decisions. You know? <laughs> styling and shrinky. Shrinky. Yay. So I think we're good in like that respect. Although, is bad weather bigger than reforesting efforts? I. What I happened be is, yeah, it, this was bold. Ah, okay. That, that's what the difference right. was. Okay. Um, good, good catch there, by the way. I'm just full of good catches tonight, man. I am on. <laughs> you're, yeah. you're on. Totally on. So I'm going to make this Geor Georgia, G-E-O-R. Oh, you're actually typing it in this you time. Can, Look well, at you with all the just different Just as a shortcut. Yeah. yeah. Make it 18 point again. Kablam. And I can bring this text box down to have more copy come yeah. down here. Just as far as our page will go. Um, let's see. Get rid of that line in between those. It'll bring in a little more. Yeah. Here, I'm going to make this text one point smaller so it matches this text. Mm -hmm. Right. You said delete that. That's why. Oh, look. The whole thing fits now. Mm -hmm. Perfect. How nice. <clears throat> totally unrehearsed. Wow. There we have a, a good solid news page. Yeah, and so uh, when we go into Go Live, of course, we can make that scroll down to all sorts of other news stories. That's right. This is just uh, just for layout practice. Right, so we know what we're striving for right. when we make it to Go Live. Right. 
So, uh, Wicked, I mean, with that, the uh, the news page is done, and we are ready to move on to the testimonials page. So that'll wrap it up for this video. Excellent. Thank you.